Well, as we mentioned earlier, the College of Southern Idaho is going to be hosting fireworks at their main campus tomorrow night, 4th of July. Idaho News 6 reporter Alex Grant has more on what people can expect. The firework display at CSI will surely draw a crowd as people look to get outside and enjoy July 4th. The city encourages people to take the necessary precautions while in attendance, like wearing masks and practicing basic hygiene. We're encouraging social distancing. So if you are going to cluster together, we ask that you be in the same household and that you maintain appropriate distance. Unlike previous years, the event will not have any vendors or additional activities. I know in years past, there's been people who've been selling food, you know, walk around doing balloon animals, things like that. Uh, but just because of the transmission of you know, potential illness. So we have uh, stayed away from that this year. The city wanted it known that there will be traffic complications because of the fireworks showing. At the intersection of Blue Lakes and College and Washington and College is where we kind of have our uh, barriers set up that are, um, I guess, kind of not allowing entry after a certain amount, after a certain time. While a large crowd is expected, it's anticipated that it may be smaller than in years prior due to an increase in purchases at fireworks stands. We are kind of like thinking maybe people will stay home just because, especially the ones that are really worried about catching it, they'll probably just come here, get their fireworks shows, and then go home and stay home for the night. The fireworks are set to start at 10 p.m. and wrap up around 10.30. In Twin Falls, I'm Alex Grant, Idaho News 6.